good morning. We made a long drive this morning. Uh, it's March 7th and we're going to be doing some cold water fishing. Hopefully they'll uh, want to play the game. This lake normally is really good when the water's cold, but it's really dependent on whether or not the water's clear. I don't think they've had a lot of rain down here. I haven't seen any big uh, big puddles or water running anywhere. It's kind of hard to tell with the ponds that I've driven past. They're, they're all clear of ice, so that's good. But I haven't seen any, uh, I can't tell because the sun's not up high enough yet to tell the water clarity of any of them. And I'm, I'm not from around this part of the, the state, so I, I don't know what they normally look like anyways. But, uh, as long as the water's clear, we should be able to get on some fish. And there's a lot of little fish in this lake, but there's uh, it's got a lot of big fish too. That as long as you can get past the little ones, you can get the big ones. So that's normally when I get down here when the water's cold. As long as I can stay away from the little ones, or as long as I can uh, keep a bait in the water long enough, I can get a, a good one. So that's what we're hoping for today. I'm gonna be in the kayak. It's the same thing I was in last time I was down here. So. Wind's not going to be too bad, is what they're saying. We'll see. It's supposed to be warm, so there's always a chance early in the year that that wind's going to blow, but I'm hoping that it won't. I'm pretty much depending on it not blowing since I'm in the kayak, but we'll see. Anyways, uh, we're just about to the lakes. We're going to get there, get set up, and hopefully get on some fish. We'll see you out there. for a whole 10 minutes before I got a bite. Large moth here spot. Spot. Little fella. It's a little guy. I guess I fished for almost 13 minutes. But I'm on the board. One of the ones I heard hit it. Quack. The colored, colored up little spotted bass. I got you too. At least you ate it good. Not the biggest one, but he's a fish. Slowly doing something.
there's two in a row that I've heard smack you. There's a bunch of shad must run on the top right here next to me. Our spotted bass in Kansas don't get very big, so this is a pretty quality individual. Right at 14. Fourteen and a quarter maybe. At any rate. Pretty nice one. I'd like a picture of him because I may not get a bigger one than that. Seems to be a few fish right here. They may all be spots, but I don't really care. I don't got it pretty good too. I will take that for show. On number five, Fritz side. Pops open like a jack in the box. Right at 16. Maybe not 15 and three quarters. Either way, nice fish. Two hours later, I finally caught another fish. I wish that was a joke. 
almost went through a whole battery. The dam is three quarters of a mile away. Oh, that's a big that giant. The good one I was hoping for. Dang, you guys are making me work for you this morning. Yeah, I like got cold last night or something. That's a better one. Better old jerk bait eater. I haven't got to put one on my new catch board. And I got it for tournament, so So close to a 16, 15 and three quarters though. It's a nice, nice little fish. Keep her on a lot of lakes in the state. Thank you. Okay, we're out of here. 
Uh, that was not nearly what I had hoped for. This lake's typically a lot better than that. Especially, I had good conditions. I'm not real sure what was going on, uh, other than we had that really cold snap, like everywhere pretty much did a week and a half ago, two weeks ago, I guess. And there was, even with the really cold water, there was a ton of shad screwing around on the top, so. And the fish that I caught were extremely fat, so I don't know, maybe they had reaped the benefits of a bunch of stunned shad and maybe they just weren't, weren't very hungry. It's best I can think, but the only good bite I had pulled off. I don't know why, other than it's cold and they just kind of like to nip at the bait sometimes, but oh well, caught some fish, it's a nice day getting there. Spring is around the corner and I'm ready for it. So, I don't know. Might go out for a little while tomorrow. Just uh, close to the house but we'll see. But until next time, hope to see you up. But, uh, hope to see you then. But wherever uh, wherever that is, that is, can't talk today, I guess. Wherever that is and whenever that is, we'll see you out there.